First, make the GUI for the dialog box. I added a UI corner and a UI stroke to my one. Set the anchor point of the dialog box to 0.5, 0.5. I then made the profile picture for the NPC talking. After that, I added a text label to the dialogue frame. I added a viewport frame to the image label, and a world model to the viewport frame. After, I made the NPC. He's called Gerald. Add a proximity prompt to your NPC. Onto the script. Make a variable for your NPC. Then add a triggered event to the NPC's proximity prompt that you added to it. We'll come back to that later, but now make a module script. Make a variable for the screen GUI. Make another one for the dialog box. The make one for the text label inside the dialog box. Make a function called activate inside the script. Add the two parameters, text and interval. Make two new local functions called open dialog and close dialog. Add tween service and make a tween for opening the UI. Inside the open dialog function make a new tween. That tweens the dialog box to its normal size. Before the tween starts, set the dialog UI's size to zero. Then wait for the length of the tween plus a small amount of time. In the dialog close function, make the GUI tween to zero size. And then set its visible property to false. Once the tween is finished, Make a new function called write text. Make a for loop to loop through the text parameter. Set dialog text to an empty string at the start. Then just add on the text to the string. And then wait the interval parameter. After the for loop, wait a small amount of time. Then set the dialog text to an empty string. Now in the activate function, call all of the functions you made. Now go back into the local script. Require the module script then call the activate function. 
create an a bool variable called active and check if it is true. An activate is called It works. Now we are going to make the PFP for the NPC. Here is what my workspace looks like. First make a variable for the PFP. And the viewport frame inside the PFP frame. I did a lot of tweaking and this function seems to work well. Pause the video to copy it down. Also in the activate function add a new parameter called NPC. Make a new function called close PFP. Loop through the world model and delete everything inside it. Then destroy the camera. It works. Now we will give the dummy new dialogue. Make a new module script inside the local script and call it dialog data or something. Inside the module script, make it return a table of all of the dialog for the NPC you created. Now require that module script from the local script. Make a variable to detect how many times the NPC has spoken. Make an is active function in your dialog module script and return the active variable. Copy what I do. Here is what my local script looks like. It will go through all the dialogues you put in the module script. Join the Discord for any issues. I hope you successfully made your dialogue system. After you finish the text, it won't let you speak anymore. Bye!